hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel my name is eliza at eliza journals and today i am going to be just journaling in my hobonichi techo five year for thursday and friday and i am using a banu vodka on the rocks fine nib fountain pen and the color i actually have in this is robert oster honeybee if anyone's interested in knowing what color it is so today of course is just gonna be a little chatty just want to talk to you all about like what is your journaling process like so if you're out there and you journal or you're like a planner like what is your process like I've always just wanted to ask people do they have a specific routine of how they journal what is it like do you journal in the mornings do you journal in the evenings do you journal at night so just tell me in the comments what your routine is like and let me know some things that you write in your journal you know that you want to share that's not really personal um i just find myself using this journal well to be honest my Hobonichi Techo 5 year is actually my main memory keeping journal. However, it you're really supposed to write in this journal every like once a day on each page, but of course, I turned it into a weekly journal because I like seeing all the things on one page. I really just didn't see the I re to be honest, I really just didn't understand why you should be writing on one particular space like each day. I just didn't see the reason for that. So I just love seeing it on one page like every single week. And this journal I've had for like the last four years and I absolutely love it. The binding is coming loose, but I'm trying to be as delicate with it as possible. So I'm really just using this journal to just journal like little bits and pieces because I know y'all probably like, what, what exactly are you journaling? Because it's so tiny, like you don't have a lot of space to write so i pretty much just journal like the little bit of things that were significant to me throughout the day um and of course if y'all have seen my other videos i do have another memory keeping journal my midori habino where i pretty much go into more detail so let me know in the comments if you have more than like one memory keeping journal or even if you have one other journal or more than one journal that you journal in and what are some things that you write in both of your journals or three of your journals so i'm trying to figure out for next year do I want to just have my Hobonichi Techo 5 year as just my main memory keeping journal? Do I want to have another journal? So I'm just really conflicted right now because I want to use all the things and I just can't figure out what I want to do. And to be honest with y'all, I literally purchased a or Estelle which that is just like my work planner but I also saw that or Estelle just came out with some Tomo River paper planners for 2025 and I absolutely love the 2025 weekly layout y'all it is like super amazing so in my mind I'm thinking oh man maybe I should have waited <laughs> You know, because I I figured that it's getting close to that time, to that new year. And I pretty much just journaled, you know, today how just pretty much like how my day went. And that, you know, 
I hopefully would love to see or still come out with some new planners and then I'm recording this like pretty much like a week after this spread so pretty much I'm really talking to you now like futuristic <laughs> so um but she came out with some adorable planners and now I'm really like oh man like maybe I should have waited and order both of them together but the Tama River planners for 2025 are on pre-order but anyway I just wanted to get on here and just do a little journal with me and to see how you all were doing and what is your planner set up for next year so just let me know in the comments as well what your planner set up is for next year what do you plan on journaling or planning for next year do you separate your planners and I tend to separate my planners so I have like a fitness planner a catch-all planner and just all the things so just let me know what you decide to do for next year and thank you for coming along with this journal with me sorry I didn't really talk about what I journal you can catch that over on IG but thanks for watching if you stay to the end put a green heart in the comments and until next time thanks for watching bye